Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Gah! Sneaky das bags. They scrambled the power circuit, so I can't release them. I grow tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. I... Hey, visor's up, now what? Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. So this is my third attempt at doing this specific mission, and I gotta admit, I'm pissed. When I play games, I play just to enjoy myself, not to be so... Other than being a giant pain in the tail. It's a peacekeeping ship. So Capable frustrated at violence. even trying to maneuver, let a alone figure this whole thing violence. out. Like, this is the Crew most suckiest mission I've ever had the displeasure of even Looks doing like in the, the first place. And honestly, while I record this, I'm actually doing a tutorial right now on how to do this stupid mission. I'm pissed. Drax, this is so unnecessary. To the grid. And you will have one. And honestly, if it wasn't for the tutorial, I would be so lost. I would actually quit. If a game makes me that frustrated, I would quit entirely. And I have done so before. This won't be the first nor the last. Come on, man, come on. Did that do anything? There you go. You'll have to reroute a couple of them. The fact that it took me 10 minutes to figure out that I had to switch my controls and do this. Like, this is ridiculous. Should we be concerned? Okay, so I did that one. Now I have to do this one, right? Cool. I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Got that. Root, root boost thing. Thank you. Awesome. I see it now. You got half of it rerouted. Now work on cool. the other room. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that. Okay, so now that this room is all set. Let me just go and say, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, subscribe to my channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And also hit the notification button as well so you know when I upload my videos. Also, my coloring book, Taco Dreams, is available on Amazon. Pick up a copy today so you can start coloring. Okay, so the next one I need to go to would be this Perhaps room no over here, based machines. off he of I was an the, on a based was off of life. the how-to guide right here. So we're gonna go Need all the help, way buddy. up Root here. Boost, nice. That's all I need anyways. Thank you. Okay, and then we're gonna go through this small tunnel over here. Right? Perfect. The fact that this is my third attempt is so annoying, honestly. Okay! I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here. Solid plan. Right? Is that it? Maybe. Simple. Required professionals. Yeah, the poocher don't even need to lift the paw to take down Lady Alvander's invincible goons. Needs us. Real life. Good. We agree on something. Okay. Perfect. And. Hey well, there. Anyone else feeling ready to move on? Yep. Indubitably. Hold on. Let me see something. Huh? What did that open? 
an outfit for this kid that I already got, so that's not an issue. And... Everybody stay alert. Quill has a knack for pushing the wrong buttons or crossing the wrong wires. A boo-hoo! insinuating you are bad luck. Funny how the small, hairy one is always right there guiding me. Peter Quill is insinuating that you, Weasel, could... Okay, I should be good from here, uh, right? Lumpy's bugging everybody with his color commentary. It has to be up there. Got it. And then... Right here. Yep, this door is going to lead me to the Door's other open, one. And I got the power flowing through. Almost nice. Thank goodness for this here. guide. Thanks. Seriously, I would have been so lost. Okay, so head to the other piano on the other side of the room. Perfect. And then from here, the bottom one. Wow. That's all I needed. Beautiful. This is what I like to hear. Groot's right. Maybe we should just call Cosmo, tell him we tried, and port the flark out of here. It ain't our fault Scut was locked down. We will not fail at our mission. I mean, that sounds great and all, but we usually fail at our missions. Clamps are unclamped. Slick. Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Okay, now, cool. I'm coming. Without your button pusher. All right, I'm here. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. It must be important to their effort. You can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. And then get back to Cosmo for our reward. All right, this is our floor. All right, let me see how I can damage Doors this. Are tight. Okay, this has potential. Rocket. Rocket. Blow it up. Open that panel. Nope, don't have the right tools for that. Okay, uh, Drax, Drax smash it. that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. What is this? Oh, great. I really hope I don't fall. This is not the right time to, the to just we'll get die. Have a few laughs. What's that? Uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Whoa. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? Oh, damn, That's that was it? quick. In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Oh, that's cute. Just for that, I'm gonna go and give you your outfit. There you go. Your Nova Corp outfit. I hope you enjoy. You're welcome. Let's shimmy on through. Man, this is crazy. Crazy. I do not like that last mission at all. Whoa! Flark and Scott! What are these Franklin Gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know! Looks like it's siphoning something! Something to do with those cubes? No, no! I gotta get a closer look! Peter Quill, we have been in this hangar before! Hey! Remember the weird ceremony the priest was leading on the rock? Yes, his red robes are burned into my memory. Yeah, yeah! He had some kind of device sucking the life out of those brainwashed bucketheads. Is that what they're doing to Contraxia? This is where the churchman's shuttle exploded. Yeah, well, it looks a little different now. Because of the giant machine, yes. But I assure you, Peter Quill, this is where you and the girl almost fell to your deaths. Oh, this is it, huh? Great. The world would never have allowed this to happen to a ship. So, you think she escaped? I don't know. She could be holed up in her office. <laughs> We're not leaving till we find out what happened. That's right. I need to find so out what, what happened to it? the kid. I think they're using and the my ex some kind of battery. <gasps> Standard galactic I.O. ports. Regalian glass mat separators. Three cathodes! I understood some of those words. I ain't never seen nothing like it. Energy readings are all over the place. 
but I can't tell what kind of energy it is. What the fuck? What? Okay, so. So let's go. Thank you. Woo, this is crazy. We gotta destroy this thing. We don't even tell know me. What it is. Plus, we'd probably end up taking out the entire ship. And off with it. You know what? Let's go. Come on. Whee! Oh no. Let's avoid the scary beam. Good advice. Guardian of Galaxies, Cosmo check. Investigation lead him to believe our home is key to galaxy mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Atraxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what is happening. They've got this giant ray thing he pointed at the planet. It's collecting some kind of energy. Have Guardian found Centurion Corel? Not yet. Guardian must find them. May have answers we need. Okay, so I guess we'll find her to get the answers. Which means we can go over here since that's the only thing item. I can device, think tracks. of. Oh no. What is Woo! Whoa! Whoa! Come on! Come on! Make your peace! There you go! There you go! Right here! Come on! Thank you! Woo! That's a good amount! Come on, Drax! There you go! Nice effort out there, team! Let's keep it up! Oh, there's more. Okay. You got this one. There you go. There you go. Okay, this this is doable for me. There you go. Oh no. Ooh. I am flying by because I'm not gonna hit. I'm not gonna get hit by these things. That's what I'm trying to do. Ooh. Make like a tree. Gonna stop the rocket. I admire your insistence, Peter Quill. Woo! Right here, Drax. Look out! Sick. You owe me one I actually did that. Come on. Come on. These guys are definitely a lot to handle. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. What? Woo, yes, we need a huddle because I'm. I don't know what to do. It's barking crazy out there, Quill. I know. Can scum nuts soak up bullets like you wouldn't believe. Trust me, I know. And return every beating I deliver with equal force. We're gonna be in real trouble if we don't stop him. Listen. Listen. You think we're in trouble from these guys? Well, I say trouble is our middle name. When we're slicing scuts with a knife or a blade, and we're shooting fast and groups making shade, that's what I call trouble. Who's with me? I see. Nice one, Peter. Time the. Time to go. Busy, crew. Let's go. I wondered how we would fare against the Centurion. More jabbing, less jibber jabbing. Load up, 
There you go. There you go. We got this. We got this. Right here. Right here. Woo! I'm trying. Right here. Boom. Sick. I wish, I know, I wish. Okay, Alright, he's like down. Shit might be ground zero for whatever's happening. We gotta find Corral, get some real answers. You have any idea where she is? I'm thinking we check her office. I even know how we can get there. You know a way out of the hangar? Yeah, Drax spotted it on our way in. We can use the hole Nikki and I fell into when Raker's shuttle exploded. You know, we never did. Drax, I'm gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. Yes, I do. Let's go. Come on. That seemed like a wasted effort. All plans need steps to succeed. Ugh, what new age drivel have you been reading? We need to stop the batteries from moving, Peter. All right, first of all, ooh, what's this? Any idea why they need so many of these batteries, Rocket? Dog report item. The rumbling continues. Or contraxia. First of all, how am I supposed to... If we had the Milano, I could drag one of these battery things aboard. You could? I mean, we could. Me and Drax. Perhaps, if you ask nicely. I, I don't know what to do here. Hold on. Uh, heavily suspended, manufactured object, support line compromised. So what do I do? Like, I don't, I don't get it. Okay, I'm having another brain fog moment. Them? I am recognizing a vast amount of work completed in a short time. Oh, look at that. Rocket, get inside. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything to get out of here. We should cool. be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machinery. Rocket, are you okay? I've done my part. Yeah, thanks. Keep in mind, it may not stay jammed forever. We still need a way through. So, let me see. How am I supposed to... The energy in this hangar is causing my hair to stand on end. Oh, yeah. yeah. My first frizz. Wait a tick. You're as bald as an asteroid. Not true. My legs are covered in a fine down. What do I do? Can I shoot? Or should I do this? No, I don't know what to I do. I wonder if we could have stopped there's no point in wondering what could have been. We must move forward. Find out what happened here. Okay, so... What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to be doing? Obviously, I'm supposed to go through here, right? So, any new ideas on what the oversized vacuum's actually doing to Contraxia? None of them good. I don't get it. I don't know what to do here. Oh, that's what I had to do. Okay. If the weirdos don't kill us, the radiation might. Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. I just hope it does not cause an explosion. Let's not stick around to find out. Come on, let's go. Come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. I got lucky an figuring Spread that out. thing out. Be contained by, by her, her will. will. What? There's too many of them. In the hole, jump. Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Not the dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey, Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. 
So use tunnels to avoid enemies. Oh, I gotta jump through here. Okay. Oh, woo. Okay. Nice. And how will the rest of my crew come? Ah, oh, okay. Hold on. I got this. Thank you. And then from here, we can do the bridge. Hey, this is the same Ready, spot sir. me this and that right. girl went Ready, through. Sir? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. rocket. No. Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. Right, so we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. So, can I do this? Do your magic, group. So, how did you and Nikki get through here last time? I don't remember anything being in the way before. Just a lot of fire. The guys are up already. Figure something out. Got it. I already did. Because I'm awesome. Okay. And also, I have a strong so suspicion that Nikki's my kid. The captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corral mm. survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. <laughs> Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. Nikki's one of the most resourceful kids I ever met. And Corral's a warrior. I'd bet on both of them any day of the week. Don't get cocky. Whoa, watch out! You Woo, let's go, come on. It says we should start thinking about exit plans. <laughs> the exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. It does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. True. Yeah, or getting your... You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. <sighs> the hell's this? Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There better be, because there's no way I'm walking through that. What about your magical ice weapon, Peter Quill? Oh yeah, Perhaps you're you enjoy right. Contemplating the intoxicating stench of death. Right here. Glorious. Okay, we got one. There. Breathe That's breathe. you. Okay, that was bad, even for you. Got that. Nice. Uh, more death gas. I know, Maybe it's weird. Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and hear me out on this. Maybe they're dead. You know what, man? Damn, Rocket. You're a real jackass, like way more than usual. Tension is palpable. Can you both Pete, just tell them that there's a possibility that Nikki I could be. Your issues or fight to the death. Look, Rocket. I know His kid. I suck sometimes. We all suck sometimes. Pretty sure it's why we ended up together. I do not suck. Point is, I care about us. But right now, we're not the ones in danger. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are, right after we check here. There you go, I found the hideout. Nice. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. I know, right? Didn't it's pretty Nikki cool. Did all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki? Little one, reveal yourself. Maybe try being a little less scary. It's Peter. The the, the pirate. Nikki, <laughs> we do not intend to kill you. We need to get into that room. Maybe this is it. Two for two. Thank you, Nikki's passkey. 
Ooh, what's that? <gasps> the toy. Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming her stuff now? Because if we are. No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. What happened? This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have her toy? It's just something I gave to Corral when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does uh, this mean anything? How old <gasps> is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill. You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is 12. Quill yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. As long as they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Yep, now everyone knows. I might. That's my kid. It has to be at this point, Anyone right? Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Wait, wait, hold on. Could that really be him? Not at all what I was expecting. Is that good or bad? He's not like other adults, I mean, sort of, but he's also kind of a big, dumb kid. Oh, come on, Nikki. Um, he thought my art was cool. Do all terrains dress like that? And if so, why? Ouch. Mom would not talk about him. She says I should forget we ever met, which is all the more reason to keep digging. Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. Oh, come on, man. Now that you know, say it like this that. Guy's her dad. Yeesh. Looks like an even bigger deadbeat than you. Oh, cut Still it can't out. Still get over how good she is with all this tech stuff. Staring at it ain't gonna change what it says. It and doesn't she's say shoe. anything. Guess Nikki wasn't much of a Skrull fan. Name someone who is a Skrull fan. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. All right, well, I'm gonna craft this one. Doing, doing, okay. Where were we? done. Congratulating you on being a father. Okay, let's Should get to, be to Corral's office the office. Those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. Okay. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> Guys. Shut up, Drax. Do not make light of all this. We still don't know if they're okay. I am capable of feeling concerned while still laughing at you, Peter Quill. Ditto. Ooh, what is this? Ah. Let's go. Come on. Got to admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Cut yeah, it I out. I can see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she Excuse gets everything me? from the mother's side. Yes, she should have exhibited at least some foolishness. Oh, come Maybe on. Maybe it's a trait that kicks in later. <laughs> hey, uh, Quill. You know okay, you know Drax is clearly on to something, so let's all just go with that. That's the elevator I took with Corell and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever oh, come on. Another fighting scene. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Let's go. So was this a coincidence, or did they know we were coming? You should try asking them. Yeah, I really hope my kid and my ex lovers alive, because I I would be feeling some type of way. There you go. There you go. Yes. What? Awesome. You're gonna start being all paternal now? We're Shut fine, up. Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just. We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corral's office was up top somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Just need to make our way up. Okay. So right here, right? Cool. Next stop, Corral's office. Let's go. 
Come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's got to be eating at you. The prospect of maybe being a dad is a little scary. A little. Embrace the panic, Peter Quill. It is the essence of fun. Embrace the panic? What the hell? They are really not a good support system. I could tell. Like, damn. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.